finally get to play this game. Let's go. Soul Hackers 2. Three days late, but let's go. Start. And let me adjust my mic a bit. Okay, so voice settings. Uh, do we play with English or Japanese? That is the hardest question. Let's go with English so that way everyone can hear it. I kind of want everyone to be able to enjoy it, so let's do English and new game. Um, I'm going to prioritise performance because performance is always the coolest thing to prioritise in games like this. Alright, let's change these settings. Alright, the BGM I want to kind of put a bit down. Sound effects up. Hey. Voice effects up. Um. Don't need demon swap when memory. Um, no, because sometimes you don't actually want to equip your demon and you might just use it because you have to. Yeah, th that is good. Um, I kind of want to center, center Ringo. Message speed default, because obviously, yeah. Is there anything I missed? Battle curse on memory. Um, you might or you might not. To be honest, the annoying thing is, is it's good when you want to use the same move again, and it's bad when you don't. So let's just keep it on for now. And we'll change it as we go along. Oh yeah, hello, uh, Lowen. I was gonna ask you about that because um, I noticed uh, you disappeared, and I was gonna—I didn't know whether or not to tell you, but I feel like it might have been a bannable account for the last part of your uh, username. All right, we're going hard. There's. No continues, no using items during battle. Whoa, jeez, that's that's actually evil. Should we do very hard just for a laugh? Yeah, let's go very hard. Just for the laugh. And then we'll see how it goes afterwards. This is a work of fiction. Names, characters, places and incidents either are products of the author's imagination or used fictionally. The crimes, beliefs and injustices of the story are not intended to malign any existing faith, group or ideology nor reflect views of its creator. It is the middle of the 21st century. Technological progress has plateaued and lives and societies of humanity are now defined by a slow stagnation. Yet from the abstracted, date-rich sea of Earth's information, new life has evolved. Presenting Atlas. I'm glad you're back though, Lowen. Is the connection going okay or is it playing up? Because it looks like it's playing up on my end. Ringo. <clears throat> Ringo. Ion is a conscious consensus, born from the sea of information, without beginning or end. Though aeons pass, Ion is eternal. Ion denies all forms of boundaries that define the individual self. Contradiction identified. You have addressed me as Ringo, requesting immediate correction. I am Flamma. I was created so that the will of Ion can be put into words. Words will be a contextually vital tool for your objective. 
The objective of Ion is evolution. Individual existence indicates extreme retrogression. Finite physical manifestation classified under the above category. Requesting explanation regarding the necessity of a corporeal form. Our causal calculations have identified an imminent sequence of events. Ion has determined that these, these events, events represent a catastrophic threat, threat to, the to the future of humanity. So hackers too, low as a neutral observer is temporarily being suspended. Direct intervention is required to identify and intercept the cause of this threat. Therefore, a material form is required for material intervention. I understand and accept Ringo as the optimal form to exit observation. As Ringo, I request that Flamma provide the calculated causal evidence to prove necessity. Open your eyes, and I will show you a vision. Can you do so? I've been honestly looking forward to playing this game, Loan. And yeah, it is an interesting game. I don't know if you're a fan of RPGs though, because this is what it is. That was pretty dope. That's a good way to introduce a game. Good morning, Ringo. Morning, Fig. So, you got born into this mess too, huh? How are you feeling? Like, like I mean, just yeah. Five minutes minutes ago. It hasn't been that long. If we assume this world was created at the precise moment we attained sentience, that would be 12 seconds ago to be exact. Your individual personalities appear to be functioning as intended. Hey, Flamma? Who are we exactly? You are constructs. Your purpose is to protect the world of humanity. More specifically, you are temporary and limited manifestations of Ion. The situation will require versatility in approach and judgment. Therefore, you have been created with personalities designed to differ from each other. I mean, I'm not doubting Ion's grasp of cybernetics. These bodies seem state-of-the-art and even organic-ish, but... I thought Ion had a policy against taking physical form. And giving us our own senses of self? I think that's a pretty obvious downgrade considering. <laughs> I think. Listen to me. If they created us, then they're resorting to drastic measures. I take it we're dealing with a crisis? The world of humanity is coming to an end. I take it that's the point of the vision you showed me. 
No worries, Lowen. Thanks for coming by and have a good time with your friends. So that's our mission, then. Directly intervene in the human world and prevent their deaths. Thus averting the apocalypse? Precisely. Ion's reason for existence is to acquire information and evolve. To that end, we must ensure the world is protected. Okay, so... Who are these guys exactly? One is Ichiro Onda, a renowned computer engineer and a luminary in his field. The other is a devil summoner named Arrow. Sorry, Devil Summoner? The necessary information has already been provided to both of you, as well as abilities suited to your mission. And this is a... Huh. I see. So this is what Devil Summoners used to fight. Assume this mission will involve combat? Correct. Your new bodies have been adjusted for this eventuality. However, if your forms are damaged beyond our estimations... Then we could wind up dead, as much as any human would. Correct. You are accordingly advised to exercise caution in your investigation. Sheesh. Okay, fine. I call the Devil Summoner. Fig, you take the Engineer. Understood. Designating Ichiro Onda as Target Alpha, and Arrow as Target Beta. Mission status initialized. This will be Ion's first contact with the human world. Let's make sure we do this right. Let's go. Hopefully they throw us into the action. Wow, the loading screen looks like Triforces. That's actually dope. Check. One, two. Ringo here. Currently en route to positional coordinates for target beta. What's the situation on your end, Fig? I was too late. Target Alpha, Dr. Ichiro Onda, has already been killed. A murderer's purged local surveillance footage, too. But I did find a final message on the doctor's personal device. It was scrambled with an advanced level of quantum cryptography, though. Beyond any human technology's capacity to decipher. Almost sounds like it was meant for us instead. So what's the message behind all that encryption? Covenant. That's all. Covenant. An infrequently used synonym for contract. Though there's likely a deeper meaning here escaping me. Possibly another code. I'll keep analyzing. Sounds good.
Seriously, though? Couldn't Flamma have given us a drone or something? This body is so inconvenient. My surveillance range is tiny with just these two viewports. Our interference in the human world must be concealed by any means possible. Ion's mandate for this mission is maximum secrecy. It's safe to assume we won't be receiving any reinforcements, drone or otherwise. But your point is made. I'll look into alternatives. Yeah, sure. Maximum secrecy. But now they've made two humanoid platforms and they're even calling for direct intervention. I assumed Ion's whole thing was always being an observer and nothing else. So this must must be way beyond. <laughs> Rigo? Sorry. Just started raining over here. Wow. Crazy. I can feel my skin reacting to this. It's all weird and shivery an understandable reaction considering we've never experienced it before you'll just have to get used to it yeah great like how we have to get used to being stuffed into these bodies I'm like a factory made sausage why bother with these human imitations they're not exactly optimal our computing's just down across the board is this really going to help us somehow? Ion's findings suggest that these bodies would be most appropriate for the mission. It strikes me as a form of backwards compatibility for the task at hand. Backwards compatibility I can deal with. I'd just rather not feel like a supercomputer stuck inside a grandfather clock. If you have complaints, please direct them to Flamma. You're not the only one struggling to adapt. Fine. Guess I won't get anything done by whining. As long as I'm stuck in this Qualia prison, I might as well have some fun with it. We're not here for fun, Ringo. How about we cut the comms for now? I gotta focus if I want to get used to this body. Understood. There are hostile demons and devil summoners in the area, so be careful. I'm on my way as well. Demons. Supernatural entities of myth and legend. Their existence has been tied to mankind's for ages, but even Ion doesn't know too much about them. And devil summoners, let's see, would be the humans who make contracts with these demons, using their demonic partner's powers as their own. So it looks like I've got a comp and a demon summoning program. This is all I need to fight back, huh? Seems simple enough. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's get this show on the road. Let's go. Finally some action. All right, I don't know how very hard it is. This could be crazy hard, so we need to watch out. Let me check around the area before I move forward. Can she jump? Um, no. She cannot jump. Interesting. I press the two t triggers, it shows current location, but I don't really need that. Alright, it's time. First battle, I reckon. Tell me. Oh, 
Well, he's dead. Great. So much for starting things off right. Isn't it kind of a ironic he has a t-shirt with bullseye on it and he got shot in the head? Like, Rainbow, damn. Have you a savage. Oh, I found him. See for yourself. Target acquired. How horrible. Cause of death is... Well, I don't really need to spell it out, do I? Bullet to the head. One and done. Then the end of the world is... Right then. Ringo? Just what are you planning to do? I'm gonna try a soul hack. If there's any of his soul left in there, I should be able to gather him up and put his psyche back together. But there's so much we don't know about soul hacking. And it's not meant for bringing people back from the dead. reason we have so many limiters on that function, Ringo. If it fails, you'll be the one who ends up paying for it. Hey, if we're not prepared to use all the tools we're equipped with, that's just a waste, right? We don't do this right now, and we can say goodbye to whatever leads we might have had. The entire world's at stake here. <sighs> hey, it's nice to know that you care, though. Especially seeing as we were just born. It's kind of weird, actually. Soul hacking will leave you completely exposed to the enemy. Can you at least wait until I'm there? Well... There's no telling how much a human soul will change once its body's up and gone. All we know is, the sooner we do this, the better. Understood. Just know that if you get lost in his memories, you won't be coming back. Do you understand me, Ringo? You are irreplaceable. I need you to remember that. Thanks, Fig. But don't worry. I'll make sure both of us get through this mess. For now, I better get started. Invoking emergency override. Self-regulation suspended. Self-check process suspended. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. Systems are go. Agent now sampling the target soul's wave signatures. Complete. Soul sync. Complete. Process complete. <clears throat> A 
Okay. Let's see this soul of yours, Arrow. to go deeper. This... this must be a memory. Well, this is the only world we've got. No point wasting all our time moping about it, or turning into jerks. Licensed. Now you're officially an agent of Yadagarasi. Congratulations, Arrow. I know how hard you've worked to reach this point. It's all so clear now. I was the one who was wrong. I'm sorry. Here we go. This is my soul. What are you doing here? Oh, so you're aware, huh? Did you know you're dead, too? I did. Didn't exactly go out peacefully, did you? Look, could you just leave me alone? I'd like to spend my final moments in peace. So you're just gonna drown yourself in regret? How do you know about that? Well, I only know bits and pieces. I saw some stuff on my way down. So just what is it that you regret so badly? Who... Who are you? And why are you inside me like this? My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. An agent of... Ion? Ion is an eternal, unchanging, ultra-intelligent observer of the times, born from the farthest reaches of technology. And the situation dictates that I have to look like a person right now because, you know, reasons. Wait, so... you're not human? This has got to be a joke, right? Singularities typically occur outside of the public eye, but here's one right now, standing in front of you. 
All right. So why are you here? I'm here to bring you back. You're gonna help me prevent the end of the world. The end of the world? Very soon, your soul will disappear. And your chance at coming back will go with it. If we don't act now, the world's as good as gone. So, come on, Arrow. You gonna help me stop this or not? Think of this as a second chance. A chance to get it right. Let it end here. Welcome back. <sighs> Hello? You good in there? Soul back where it should be? You're... Ringo. You're... an agent of Ion. There we go. Glad that actually worked. Did all of that really happen? It wasn't a dream, was it? Nope, that definitely wasn't a dream. You got shot in the head, I used my fancy ion superpowers, and then you came back. Even my wounds are all closed up. Did ion's power do that too? That's more like a side effect. With the soul restored, the body heals by reflex. Like a macro-level juiced-up homeostasis, which organic cells already do. A soul hack can draw out all kinds of weird spiritual contingency effects, and that's one of them. That said, it's a pretty drastic measure. Can't just bust it out whenever I feel like it. I think I get it. Whoa, you bought it that easily? You're not even a little suspicious? Wait, so it wasn't real? Was it just an illusion or something? A, a demon spell? Oh no, it's still totally real. Oh, of course. I mean, it felt pretty real. So, I died and now I'm back. Kinda get used to weird things in my line of work. Though coming back from the dead is definitely a first. I didn't even know that was possible. You ought to get out more. I guess I have you to thank for this. So, uh... Thanks, Ringo. Anytime. Okay, I'd better move. I need to get back to my mission. Whoa, whoa, hey, Arrow. Mind if I tag along on that mission of yours? I get the feeling you and I might be on the same side. You know how to fight? Of course I do. Wouldn't be bragging about saving the world if I couldn't. Well, sure. Just like that again. No questions asked, huh? Don't have time for questions. Besides... After what happened back there... 
I guess I just know I can trust you. With how bad this mission's gone, I'm not in a position to turn down help anyway. So I'll follow my instincts. Doesn't matter if you're a robot. Robot's kind of reductive. Well, Ringo, whatever you are, I'm glad you're on my side. For the record, I'm Arrow, a devil summoner with Yatagarasu. Yatagarasu, huh? A supranationalist group based in Japan. They work behind the scenes to protect civilians from supernatural threats. Most of our operatives are devil summoners, like me. We summon and command demons to help us fight. That's why I was here. Yadagarasu had me on a mission to protect a woman named Milady. Which you totally botched and got your skull ventilated. Say no more. So now we just look around this area for Milady? Yeah, that's the idea. Come on, this way. Okay, Fig. Mr. Beta's secure and back on his feet. For now, I'll be working with him to rendezvous with a human named Milady. Noted. I'm glad to hear it. I'm on my way. Well, at least we're not on the fast track to the apocalypse now. Hopefully. Oh, damn it, I'm going the wrong way. Right, let's do this. Left or right? Okay. Um, that's Arrow, right? I'm guessing we get... Oh, no, it's not Arrow. Some random dude. What the... Arrow? I thought Kabaragi killed you. Did we get bad intel? Damn it. Who's this? Friend of yours? He's a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. They're after Milady. Oh, so a bad guy. Damn traitor. I'll have to put you down myself. Hey, you ever fought a summoner before? Nope. Then you'd better stay back. Don't worry. I catch on fast. Just watch my back, okay, tough guy? Is that... Demon summoning program. Booting up. Weapons? Free. No more screw ups. This time you're going to stay dead. <laughs> okay, first battle. Come on, Arrow. What? Damn it! Hey, what's the problem? I, I can't summon my demons. What's going on? <laughs> can't squirm out of this one, pal! Looks like Arrow's demon control privileges got transferred to my comp. I get it. Probably a side effect of the soul hack. What? Sorry. Kind of figuring this out on the fly, but I optimized your summoning program. You what? I'll show you how it's done.
Okay. They're strong. Let's be on your oh, Z up. Remember, they might counterattack when go. How is that? No way. You use a demon's power to attack? You can do it too, you know. Give it a try. Uh okay. I'll just try to copy what you did. Let's go. Might as well test. Don't know till you try. I hope this works. Make the call, Eric. Freeze you where you stand. It's out! Oh yeah! Sabbath time! What? What's a Sabbath? It's super fun! It's super strong! It's a lot of everything! What the hell's going on? Just sit back and enjoy the show. That's like an all-out attack. I should be reading this part. When you strike an enemy's weakness, your demons will be summoned to stand by for a concerted attack. These stored attacks are term stacks. Are term stacks, yeah. Once all allies have acted and their demons have formed a stack, Ringo will order them to perform a sub united assault by all demons in the stack. The greater the stack, the more powerful the summon. So target enemy weaknesses wherever whenever possible that was a sabbath that's insane i didn't even know my demons could do that oh damn pixie wasn't even level two interesting hmm ringo i can't help but wonder about that demon summoning just now I think the reason you weren't able to summon anything on your own is because of the soul hack. Huh? Simply put, your soul was altered, and it looks like a piece of each of our souls were more or less welded together. It may be because of a difference in our ability, but no matter which way you look at it, I've got control over your demons now. And there's nothing you can do about that? Not at the moment, no. There's a lot about soul hacking even I don't understand. For the time being, you'll just have to settle for some ion enhanced summoning. That's true. And on top of that, we'll be able to use more powerful techniques like Sabbaths. Pluses do seem to outweigh the minuses here. Guess I'll just have to get used to it. Looks like you're stuck with me till the end. I've got to ask though, why'd that guy call you a traitor earlier? I was on a mission for Yadagarasu, and I wound up going undercover within the Phantom Society. They had no idea I was a double agent. had to protect Melody. So just like that, my cover was blown. The Phantom Society. That summoner we just beat was one of theirs? Yeah, and they're Yadagarasu's sworn enemy. The Phantom Society is a secret organization of devil summoners, just like Yadagarasu. Where we differ, however, is our intentions. They want one thing, to see this world destroyed. You mean... Exactly. 
The end of the world you were talking about is almost definitely linked to the Phantom Society. Things are starting to come together here in a pretty big way. Safe to say, we can count Ion's appearance as part of all that. Sounds like we better hurry then. Enemy up ahead. On the field, Ringo can slash out at enemies by pressing X. Entering battle with an enemy downed in this way can give you the advantage at a battle's outset. Oh, nice. So she can st strike. Press Y to open the command menu. There you can view the and use skills and items, check summon out or demon stats, change equipment, and save slash load game data. Also in this game, demons can be equipped to your party's comps. Depending on the demonic allies you have equipped, your party's stats and available skills will change. So switch them up to try new strategies and target enemies' weaknesses. I shall do that. By selecting help in the system menu, you can review various rules, tutorials and narrative details for Soul Hackers 2 that you've encountered in-game. By selecting save from the system menu, you can save your game progress. Save data can be loaded by going into the system menu and selecting load. While you can manually save the game, your progress is also automatically saved at specific points, such as before a significant battle. This automatically recorded save data can be loaded from the autosave slot on the load screen. I'm going to use this as an excuse to look save game now. Okay, we got an auto save. Let's save there. And let's check our stock. Oh, we only got two. In the summoner menu, you can check character's status and change their equipment. Press X to view their skills and their comp status. When changing equipment, you can select a category from the list on the right side of the screen. Okay, do I have anything I can equip? Obviously not, but... Okay. In the demon menu, Ringo and the team can equip demons as allies in battle by calling on demonic power. Ringo and the team's battle abilities, such as affinity resistances, will change. They will also be able to use skills known by their demons. Depending on the challenges you face, you can change up your lineup of the equipped demons for battle. You can also swap demons when you select a demon currently equipped by another party member. Okay. Nice. Let's... We saved game. Now let's try out the attack. Okay. Seems like everything's ready. Let's go fight this next one. Okay, bonus attacks can trigger when you touch an enemy who's been knocked down by a strike. Bonus attacks damage all enemies at the start of the battle. Nice. Okay, let's I'll see how this see goes. Yeah. That's one way to go about it. Oh, nice. Weak. So now weak to ice and electricity. Nice. Out of my way. Oh, we get to use this again. Let's go. Time for the Sabbath. Finish him. Or her, I mean. How about this? Okay, let's see how much damage it takes on very Oh, it didn't take that much. Eat Hulk. Ooh, that's dirty, this yeah, eat hole attack. Like Accessing data sorted thunder! Right on target! Let's do this again. I wanna thunder. try and destroy him as quick as possible. So Out of my way. You wanted a 
fight, you got it. <laughs> Another level. Let's go. Ah, oh, nice. Learning D is going to be super useful. Dodge gunfire as a skill. Right. Ooh. Do you know what that means? That means that actually... Uh, that a gun is a skill. Oh yeah, I see the resistance is now. There's no light resistance, I just realised. Damn. Maybe there's no light in this world and that's why. Anyway, let me heal up my man. He needs the heals. Arrow deserves heals. He's a legend. In my eyes. Can I run? Okay, I didn't have an option to run. Can I go this way? No. Okay, bring on more enemies. Hey, Ringo. Be a bit of a waste to use demons solely for fighting, you know? Oh. You mean they can be used for other things? Yeah. Recon. You can send them out to scout our surroundings. And if we get into a fight, you can just call them right back. Oh, then how about we give it a try? Come on out! Oh, oh. When you first set foot into a dungeon, your demons will perform demon, re demon recon. Your scouts demons can be found around the map. And they might introduce you to other demons they've met or hand over any items they've found in their exploration. Sometimes your demons might make discoveries connected to the story or requests, so make sure to talk to them if you see them around. Okay. That's an interesting new feature. Okay. I see Pixie. Yeah. Lala, pretty girls look good in Reed. And Reed. And even prettier in blood. Oh, Missy. Oi, chakra drops. Let's go. I'll give you this. Promise you won't tell anyone I was singing. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Alright, let's see where our other guy went. It's so weird not calling them personas and calling them demons. Because I've played Shin Megami Tensei and Persona. So I sometimes I call... The demons personas on Shin Megami, and then on Persona I call them demons. It's such a confusing thing, but it is what it is. I thought I'd run back because there's a chance that one, the other demon maybe's around here. I might be wrong though, but it's worth a try. Yeah, he wasn't. Okay, let's carry on. Honestly, gotta say that I think Ringo looks super cool. Her jacket rocks, and I love the sword. Like, so sick. Like, damn, how long is that sword, if you think about it? That's near enough the size of her standing up. Oh, there he is. I didn't even realize. Sorry. Polter, guys. Miss Ringo, wanna play catch? We can use this instead of a ball. You obtain nitrium. Later. Oh, you use it for something else. I d that text went so fast, I didn't even get to see all of it. But I think I can equip that. So let me go to... Maybe it was an item. Hold on, let me look at items. Nitrium. Okay, I don't know what it's for, but it's there. So, let's see what Nitrium can do. Okay, in we go. Open up the gates. Let's see. Is there anyone waiting for me? Ooh, Pixie again. Let's see what she's saying. This demon's interested in you, even though I'm the cuter one. Well... 
Uh, you want me to join you guys? I don't know. It sounds like a lot of drama. Let me have it. So, like, I want 1,500 yen. Sure. Well, I guess if you are gonna make a big deal about it, just keep this fun for me. Let's do this. I'm Beast Dormuth. Dormuth, and I'll call you Rin Rin. I totally do my best and stuff. I love it, Rin Rin. Such a nice name. If you choose to make contact with a demon, they will become your ally. In the summoner menu, demons could be equipped into your comps in order to add their power to your own. In equipping a demon, you can then use that demon's skills. They will also affect the summoner's stats, so equip demons that fit best for your tactics and situations. Okay. I think that's super dope that you're able to basically make a contract with a demon without battling them in this one. And it works the same as recruiting them in battle in the Shin Megami Tensei game. Where you have to give up stuff. Ooh, what's Pixie yeah. saying? La la la, pretty girls look good in red. And even prettier in blood. Oh miss. I'll give you this, promise you won't tell anyone I was singing again, okay? Yeah, because you, you were singing earlier, so why do you think that? Okay, that's good. Okay, that's another enemy. Should I equip the new demon? What moves have you got? Sand and eat. Oh my days, the resistances are bad. Like gunshots. Mm, I don't know, I... Having three weaknesses is not a good sign. I'm gonna just keep keep her like that for now. I'm gonna stick with my squad. Let's go. What's that demon? Let's go. Careful. We stand. don't know how this will go. There it is. Nice one, Okay, nice. I don't even think the Zio will work against it. Come on, let's slap this up. Easy. What's the plan here? Let's roll. I'm going to Zio again. You're done. Finished. You let's go. You got one. Go team, go. I just wish that demon we got earlier was useful. I mean, it'll probably be useful for when we unlock fusion in. Oh yeah, look, there hey. she is. Check this out, Rin Rin. It's all like limited edition and stuff. Ooh, revival bead. But it's not like it's a big deal. You see, the text, the final text part of the demon's messages just goes so fast for some strange reason. Ooh. Great, right? I did it. See that? I found what you were looking for, didn't I? Demon or aren't you proud of me for remembering? I'm going to go see what else I can find lying around. Later. I'm proud of him. Okay, I didn't hit well, but it doesn't matter. Hopefully we can still get through this without any issues. I like how they've changed it up, because normally when you uh, basically damage enemies in a Shin Megami or Persona game, you get a one more, which gives you another turn. Whereas in this one, they basically changed it to like just stack. So instead of getting that extra turn, you get stack damage, which is cool. Ooh, nice hit. See, you're you're cool in theory, but you're kind of not as effective. Don't die. Oh wow, he died. 
Does it really matter if he nice died? One, nah, you know what? It, it might have not. We got Jirai Musilage. Musilag? Or something. So weird, I can't pronounce it. Sorry. I butchered that completely. But hopefully it was something awesome. Ooh. Whoa, miss. You are all beat up. Don't worry. Just leave this to me. Well, how was that? Do you feel better? A hero should always be smiling, you know. Later. Doesn't it? The Polter guy sound a little bit like Morgana, but the pitch has been changed a little, so it's so it's like I actually have Morgana with me right now. Okay, let's open this. You sense a dangerous presence beyond this point. Are you sure you are ready to proceed? Yes. Have you found Melody yet? Wait, Arrow? But how? No time for small fry. Let's push on through. Right. Whoa, I feel like they just violated that chick by calling us right. small fry. That should okay, let's do this. There it is. Okay, let's hope this works effectively out. against her. Oh wow, it is actually weak. Let's go. You know, I'm actually glad that I resist, and I just realized that if we they hit Ringo, that Ringo would have basically Go went to the Ringo. Shadow Realm, so... Alright, hopefully, the Jirai one will be clobbered, because that aim is just to beat them as best as I can. Like, damn, yeah. that hit almost work. ruined me. I need to heal up. You know the drill. Don't be a hero. You see, we can't escape. And we can't even use items. That's the power of very hard. Alright, now that I realise that Ringo is the only one that can damage her with a weak... Let me heal up this. now. Or should I... Should I heal up or go for the attack? You know what? Go for the attack. Seven damage? That was a rip-off. I want my attack back. I feel scared. Let's go. Another one bites the dust. And we hit level four. Dodge gunfire is going to be so useful now because it actually makes one of our weaknesses less likely to hit us, which is tactical. Hee <laughs> hee, that's it. Just keep on giving stuff to little old me. Obtain the mystique. Elect argument one. Ooh. When a demon has learned all their skills, they will give, give you a gift as a sign of their appreciation. Once their skill set is complete, they'll grow much more slowly and give gifts less often. So it helps to prioritize training demons who still have new skills to learn. Interesting. Mystiques can be slotted into a comp to grant you various effects. To equip a mystique, open the command menu, navigate to summoner, select mystique. After which you can choose a mystique to equip from the list. 
Mystiques are primarily obtained as gifts from your demons. Different demons provide different mystiques, so try raising lots of demons to get a variety of mystiques. Okay, I shall do that. Ah, right. oh, nice! Hee <laughs> hee, I can keep up with the grown ups. Awesome! Great, right? <laughs> Thanks for everything, miss. Here, this is a token of our friendship. Make sure you keep it safe. Ooh, the Mystique Ice Argument. That's sure. gonna be awesome. Whoa, sick. I'm getting stronger. Is this like a growth spurt? Awesome. Learn sand. Let's go. So both Phantom and Yatagarasu are after this Melody person. But just who the heck is she? It's all you guys talk about. Melody is a devil summoner from the Phantom Society. However, they've marked her as a traitor. And what about you? You must have some reason to protect her, hmm? You gonna tell me? Well, I... Eh, it's fine. I'm sure I'll figure it out sooner or later. Let's keep moving. Okay, that but battle was a bit hard, but now it's time to equip our mystiques because um, honestly, that's going to make us even stronger. You can equip mystiques in the mystique menu. Each mystique has its own affinity and rank, and a comp must match those requirements in order to attach it. Supported affinity ranks can be checked in the stats column on the left side of the screen. It's always good to know the strengths and weaknesses of your teammates. Okay. Increases electricity power by 10%. Do it. Okay. That's good. And then... Arrow will get the ice one. Because obviously... Choice. Now people may think 10% isn't a lot. But 10% can be... <sighs> be the uh, answer to uh, scenarios where... You're 1 HP off an enemy to kill. So... Yeah, you need to always see that 10% is a positive. Because if you hit 22 damage and you need to hit 25, that 25, that 25 is almost there with the extra 10%. Because it'd be like 2.2. Which is close-ish, but not super close. If that was a bad example. I know what example I was trying to give, but I gave the wrong sort of one. But my point is, is basically you need to. That might be dangerous, Ringo. Okay, what now? Can I pass turns? Let's go. Take it away. We can target their weakness. Freeze you where you stand. I got you look that. Out of my way. Either way, it's going to be awesome having that extra ten percent. It's going to help a lot, especially while the difficulty's a bit crazy. Hopefully we win now. All according to plan. All right. What's assist? Oh, it picks a skill to use. Enemy weaknesses will be targeted if they are known. You can rely on this feature if you are not sure what to go with, or if you want to automatically go for an enemy's known weakness. Okay, I'm just gonna use Zio. I think I used Zio on the wrong one. We should be targeting the one with more health. Oh well. As Ringo said it herself just then. Too late for, for regrets. Actually, I love the nickname Rin Rin. I want to call her that. From now on, you will be my Rin Rin. But Ringo is so cool. Yawn. Man, it's getting late. What do you think, Rin Rin? Can we get away with a nap? That's so funny. Mm, it's weird. 
I just feel so relaxed around you and stuff. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I love that. That's actually pretty cool. I like how these interactions make these demons feel a bit more human. Miss Ringo, want to play catch? We could use this instead of a ball. Ooh. Aw, oh, you'd rather use it for something else? Fine. Long as we can still play this some other time. Later. Later. Oh, honestly, I'm enjoying these. Wait, am I going this way? I kind of lost track of which direction I'm supposed to be heading in. Hmm. Oh, it is round this way. I have to stop and think for a second. You sense a dangerous presence beyond this point. Are you sure you are ready to proceed? Don't proceed just yet. Save game. Saving will save our lives. So let's save. Take a deep breath. And then we say to ourselves, I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Now I'm ready. Let's fight. Put those hands up. We about to throw down. Melody. Looks like we need a change of plan. Yo, man! Yo, yo, Arrow's here. Except, you ain't no ghost. R.S. Am I tripping, man? My boys told me you were straight up dead. If they cut your mic, stay off the stage, man. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't this clown. Who's he? They call me Rob Soldier, ought to be yes. It ain't hyperbole, cause I could kill on the beat, representing the Phantom Society. Okay. That's it. That's the Covenant. No way. Whoa, whoa. Step off, homie. Phantom's gonna need all those covenants. Only way we can rain some hell down on the whole world. We're going live! Your boy R.S., he's at the head of the pack. The posers come at me and they don't come back. I drop that face like an earthquake. You throw hands with me, you made your last mistake. Let's go. Damn, I'm about to kill a rapper. But that bar <sighs> about throwing hands was sick Careful, when he Ringo. just pulled out the That's golden knuckle dusters. He's tough. They call me all rest because I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise in the COMP. So let's make this body count a one, two, three. Oh damn, I'm looking forward to crushing this dude. Alright, I need to figure out what his weaknesses are. I'm pretty sure Thunder might work on Bicorn. Fine. I'll get serious. No way to tell. Nice moves. Okay. Eat this! Secunda is so good to have early on, so I'm glad we learned it. Because I'm going to be able to exploit some Secunda. Fun. Going to drop his accuracy more and more. My man could still do some lethal damage and hit, even though we removed Go his plan. aim and dodge. Like that. 
too late for regrets now. I'm gonna make sure he's eating from a straw by the time I'm finished with him. Russia. He's not even the best rapper. I mean, he's got some bars, but doesn't mean he can use them against me. Oh. Are you serious? I, got, I reduced their aim and dodge, but they're still ruining. Okay. Accessing data. Weakness found. I need to keep attacking. That's an agent of Ion. I got this. You know the drill. Got it. Don't be a hero. Sekunda, come on. Please. We're screwed if this doesn't work. Because I need it to just. Can you skip this attack? Let me see. Okay, that's good. Alright, don't hit. Let's go. No. Defeat. We might be in trouble. Well, still in the fight. Okay, my guy's dead, but. Alright, we were gonna die. Wow. By the time I heal I would I would have might be in trouble. Wow. Yeah, I'm I'm basically gonna have to take the death here. I'm gonna have to take the L. Too late for regrets now. Oh, I just realized Secunda doesn't actually decrease their accuracy, it just decreases their gun skills. Keep that rhythm. Check it. He's building power. I won't lose. Well, but we need to fight. heal. <sighs> Danger zone. Like now. Well, I feel like I'm gonna die. Yep, I knew it. I knew. I knew very hard would pick it up and make it a bit crazier. Okay, let's see if we can try that again. Get to enjoy Soul Hackers 2 again. Boss fight is overpowered, but it's not too overpowered. Story so far. Ringo saves a devil summoner named Arrow, whose fate is apparently connected to the incoming apocalypse. She decides to help him in his mission, protecting a woman called Milady. Okay, let's see if the... I wonder if the enemies spawn back. You know, the only problem is the enemies don't spawn back, so it's kind of a sad time. But, I think we're going to beat him this time round. Because I feel like he sensed a dangerous presence. It's okay. About to beat you, Mr. Rapper. Mr. Wish Rapper. Okay, let me skip this because we've already seen this, so we're going straight to the battle. Call me all rest, cause I'm a dope MC. All my boys making noise. Okay, let's go right in. Okay. This time, let's not worry about Secunda. Let's use Bufo. I knew that it'd be something like that that works on him. Okay, the tactic is I need to maintain a certain health threshold in order to keep both Ringo and Arrow alive. Oh, that was good. We got a bit of lucky RNG just then. Looks like it'll work. A miss is worth way more than anything. So just remember that. You know the drill. Take that. it away. We can target their weak. When you get a miss, it's always a good sign. Okay, we've almost killed Bicorn, and then the hardest part of the fight will begin. Russia. Someone. Get ready. <laughs> Ooh, this is difficult. I can still not over Ringo needs to heal. Be too careful. I won't lose. 
because that is the play for now. We'll take them down. Switching the offense. Arrow uses Bufu on RS. You know, if you think about it, not having the option to heal in battle actually makes it like you're more reliable and one of your uh, characters for the heals. for the kills because they're genuine. Get what you get when you stop the landmine. Yeah, I'm the payoff and you're the punchline. Okay. Want to keep throwing disses? Let's go. Boost the tempo. I can't win. Think I'll run? Well, think again. Okay. I know we can win this. Now this is the part where we have to guard. When you guard, any damage received that turn will be halved. It's harder for enemies to inflict status ailments on you. However, ailment based proportional damage will not be halved. When your HP is low, or you're facing an enemy with a dangerous skill, it may help to play it safe and wait for a better opportunity to go on the offensive. That is very true. That's why you have to guard sometimes. When when they move, use moves like power charge, that's when you want to use the guard hopefully this don't kill are you serious there was a crit defeat I won't lose I can't lose here Ringo needs to survive all right let's hope we could take out by it is Come on, please take out Bicorn and him use Power Charger again. Because if he uses Power Charger again, that's a big win. Let's go. Glad he went for Ringo just then. Not even joking. You okay? Is there Take nothing it away. we can do? That should work. Freeze you where you stand. There it is. Man, I have a strong. sneaky feeling Careful he might now. use power charger, so Play let's heal it. again. I won't lose. Too late for regrets now. Come on. If we can kill Bicorn, it'll be alright. A bike on still alive, that's annoying. Sickle. Get ready. Ah, oh, thank you for the miss. That was actually beautiful. Arrow, you gotta <laughs> take it away. Let him have it, Arrow. Got it, Ringo. Nailed it. Good move, Arrow. He's probably okay. gonna be useful in the final Bad part shot. of this battle. So down. let's heal. Perfect timing, Ringo. Out of my way. Come on, you gotta take him out by now. Come on. We can do this. We're not losing twice to this guy. He's a B Tech rapper. Oh, let's go. We killed. Alright, power charger. Okay, for Ringo. Ringo needs to heal herself to survive. So let's hope this goes well. Yes, that worked super well. Let's go. I love it. Powering up Arrow, because if Ringo dies, Arrow's our top guy to take this out because of Boofy. Yeah, Frozen. You think you're sick because you can rap, but you talk the talk and all you did is spit crap. Hey, I just beat the rapper at his own game. Alright, we easy win now. Like we've won this. Yeah, we may have died once, but it don't matter. It's over. 
Your talk is cheaper. I'm the RS, and I don't fear no Reaper. I'm no Reaper, but I can send you to hell. So face the music, RS, and take the L. Oh, that's amazing. Let's go. Ringo just dropped some bars too. Let's go. Oh, my days. Ringo, I love you. You're, you're a waifu for life with those bars. Damn it. He had backup. Ringo. Fig. Ringo. What is this thing? <gasps> it's going into me? The Covenants. Joining with you. Covenant? Then, this was the point of Dr. Onda's message. Fig? Fig? Are you alright? Fig? I'm not detecting any abnormalities at the moment. My chest feels a bit hot, though. How strange. Huh. <sighs> So, you're a friend then? That's right. I'm Fig. I'm an agent of Ion, just like Ringo. Pleased to meet you, Arrow. Pleased to meet you, Fig. Are there a lot of your kind out there? There are only two like us. Ringo and I have the unique ability to directly intervene with human affairs. Just to confirm, Fig, are we too late to save Melody through normal means? Yes. By the time I arrived, she was already... Yeesh. Two soul hacks this quick, huh? Who'd have thought? Ringo? You can't mean... Are you going to bring Melody back? Like you did with me? Think about it this way. We know Arrow's death is somehow related to the end of the world. Arrow was trying to protect Milady. But what if we assume the trigger is not Arrow's death, but his failure to complete his mission? I can't authorize this. We don't even know if there were any consequences from the last soul hack. It'll be fine. I think I've got the hang of it. That's not the issue here. This is just to be safe. We need to be thorough, and that means cutting this thing off at every turn. And not only that, but I agreed to help Arrow protect Melody. So that's what I'm gonna do. Understood. I'll keep watch. Can I ask you to do the same, Arrow? Uh, right. Protection set to partial. Spell sequence, soul hack. <laughs> Systems are go.
process complete. This is an unjust world, a false world. Let's destroy it together. Such beauty, and so mournful too, just like him. Sure, you're the main squeeze of the man in the mask, but you're endable, expendable, so hope you brought a casket. Ooh, zip, talk about a fall. R.S. has got you with your back against the wall. I hear. Not until I know the truth. <sighs> A lot easier the second time around. And you are? Relax, lady. You don't have to glare like that. My name's Ringo. I'm an agent of Ion. I'm a super intelligent being born from the Sea of Information, and I'm here to stop the apocalypse. And what does this super intelligent being want with a dead woman? Well, Melody, how about I show you? Just come with me, and we'll go back. I'm dead, you simpleton. There's no going back. Why are you even here anyway? I'm gonna save the world. That's more than the world deserves. Okay, guess it's gonna take a little more than that. So that's it. This is where you die and you're okay with that? Because it sounded to me like you had something you still needed to do. You were running away. You wanted to survive. So take my hand, Melody. And you can survive. You'll get one more chance to make things right.
Hey, she's back! I guess it's true. Ion really is something else. So, Ion is a non-human being born from a bunch of information, and you're like a splinter of it. That much I get. That also explains how I'm back from the dead. What I don't understand is why you're here. Wait, Melody! We're not with Phantom. We're here to protect you. Hmm? What are you talking about? Right, so, uh, I'm actually with Yadagarasu. My being with Phantom was all an act. These two here are helping me with my mission. Yadagarasu? Then you're still my enemy. Only if you're still a summoner for Phantom. They're after you too, aren't they? Doesn't seem like either of us is in the best spot. Could you even go back to the Phantom Society at this point, Melody? I think it'd be kind of hard. Tch, what's your point? I'm saying we can help you. And it's not like we're asking you to spill your soul, so why not hear what we have to say? If your only concern is what you'll get out of it, that's fine. Even if you decide to act alone, a little more info couldn't hurt, right? I suppose I'll take you up on your offer. For now. Then, it looks like Melody's safe and sound. Sure took a lot of effort, though. Now then, we'll want to go over everything we've learned so far. That should help us get a better understanding of the situation. There's still way too much we don't know. Like about covenants and how you two factor into all of this. For now, we should get out of here. This place is dangerous. But where should we go? If you need a place, I've got a safe house I've been using. We should be free to talk there. <sighs> Thank you, Arrow. Let's hurry then. Let's return to the entrance and head back to the safe house. That is the n new mission. Oh wow, we can't go that way. Oh, that's actually a shame. I was looking forward to seeing what happened. Whoa, we get a portal now. Once you have discovered special waypoints known as portals, you'll be able to instantly teleport between portals within the same dungeon. They can make long dungeon treks much more efficient, so keep an eye out for them. Okay, that's actually dope as well Some pretty cool features coming into play i mean they had it in persona 5 like you had the restrooms where you could teleport between okay let's go check out this safe house story so far the covenant has appeared from milady's corpse was unexpectedly absorbed by Fig. after resurrecting the caustic milady 
the group heads to Arrow's safe house. Welcome to the safe house. Expected, but it's not bad. Glad you like it. Fig, Melody, feel free to make yourselves at home too. Thank you for everything, Arrow. <laughs> okay, let's get right into it. Arrow, you were trying to save Melody because of that light form thing, right? Guess there's no point in hiding it now, is there? Yeah, that's right. The Covenant came out of Melody and then went into me. <sighs> of course. It's because I died. I get that these Covenant things are important somehow, but I'm only just now starting to wrap my head around it. Can you tell me more about them? You two are devil summoners, after all. <laughs> all right. This is my understanding of it. Covenants are like a big source of energy, and they've been passed down from soul to soul for generations. Supposedly, these covenant holders wield great power. What kind of power? Well, simply put, possessing a covenant awakens the holder's latent abilities. In some cases, it can even spark, well, evolution. They say there's a total of five covenants out there. Having one as powerful as it is, but the effects would only go as far as the individual could take them. Now, if someone were to possess all five, then that'd be something else entirely. Gather up all five covenants, and you could... You could what? You could call forth what's known as the Great One, a being prophesied to bring ultimate destruction to the world as we know it. That's what they say, at least. Summoning this Great One is Phantom's top priority. Am I right, Melody? Please. You don't really need me to confirm that, do you, Mr. Double Agent? If the Holder dies, the Covenant gets passed on to someone else. As a result, there's almost always some sort of conflict surrounding them. What a surprise. I see now. So when Melody died, the Covenant found a new owner in Fig. These Covenants, and this world-ending Great One you mentioned. I believe these may be the seeds that make Ion's prediction come true. Gotta be. Considering we're trying to stop the end of the world, the Phantom Society's shaping up to be a pretty big obstacle. Agreed. And now that we know their intentions, we must protect this Covenant inside of me at all costs. That's going to be a problem for me. Forget it, Melody. Our summoning abilities are... changed. We don't have control over our demons. Ringo does. We think it might be due to the soul hack. Excuse me? No one told me about this. Don't look at me.
Oh, we get a nice choice. I'm gonna go side with Arrow. There's no point in blaming Arrow. He's in the same boat as you, Melody. Go ahead and explain it to her, Ringo. Well, it's not as if I wanted to take your powers. I'm not all that sure how it happened myself. I sincerely hope you don't intend to steal my freedom as a summoner. That's exactly the kind of low tactic Yatagarasu would pull. No, you've got it all wrong. I really was trying to help. Were you? Then can you prove to me that you and Little Miss High Tech here aren't in on this together? All right, that's enough. Melody, just what is the Covenant to you? I don't think I need to explain why the Phantom Society needs summoners, do I? Right. So you're after the end of the world too, huh? Hey, Ringo. Mind if I ask you something? Sure. What's up? Ion aren't human, right? So why was the Covenant passed on to Fig? What are you, really? We agents of Ion are highly intelligent beings born from a sea of information. By installing an ego into a simulated human body, the foundation is laid for a soul to develop alongside it. So a machine can have a soul? Is that so strange? Your bodies are practically machines too. Albeit fleshy ones. Even for our kind, there is still a lot about the soul that remains unknown. Like where they come from, or what they truly are. We're no experts either. But the self-evident truth is, should one accurately recreate a human body and provide it with a means of control, then a soul will naturally take root. In other words, it's not just this mechanical shell, or rather, this body at play. It's a complex chain of different physiological reactions that shape the soul. Yeah, I didn't get any of that. Okay, then we're supercomputers trapped inside grandfather clocks. In even plainer terms, our origins may be different, but we are more or less the same as humans. The trade-off is, in this form we can't operate at Ion's full power, nor do we have access to massive amounts of data like we used to. Ah, oh, I see. I guess that's why they said this form was the most ideal for our mission. Can't really soul hack if you don't have a soul yourself, can you? Oh, that's right, Ringo. I meant to tell you earlier, but I've made a new discovery. It's about Target Alpha, Ichiro Onda. If I remember right, that's the famous computer engineer. What about him? Fig was acting separately from me at the time. She was trying to protect Onda just as I was trying to protect you, Arrow. The mission was a failure, but I managed to restore the surveillance camera footage. I found a video of what happened in the 24th Ward Municipal Tower. And? He was killed by someone named Iron Mask. Did you say Iron Mask? The leader of Project C finally makes his move. It was him. So, you know him. Or well, I guess you would, seeing as you two are together. You are? He called himself Iron Mask. Are you absolutely certain? Let's take a look at the footage. Output in video.
So they're supposed to be humans, but she still has the power to output videos. Like, let's go. That's a win skill. Impressive. I can't imagine how many security measures were in your way. You're no mere trespasser. Ichiro Anda, I presume. The greatest computer engineer of our time. It's a pleasure. And you are? I am the leader of Project C. You may call me Iron Mask. <laughs> a bit on the nose. Was Black Suit taken? Or are you a prisoner broken free? Well, it's fine. You're welcome to celebrate with me, Masked Man. So is your little wallflower. It's complete. A system to shatter the status quo with a perfect name to shake the very foundation of academia. The Omni System. Glorious, isn't it? Can't you feel its power? But now it's finished and I'm done with it. If you're a thief, then go ahead and take it. You've designed a masterpiece, Doctor. The Omni System will uplift mankind to new heights. Alas, I'm afraid your part in our grand pageant ends here. We want something quite different from you. I should have known. If you don't want my creation, then you must be after me. Well, what dwells within me? You want the Covenant. Ah, you're already aware. You do know I'm a genius. Whoa, damn. Say, masked man, one last tip. Call it. A parting gift from a genius. No one can control the future. Iron Mask. I have a future. Damn, that was savage. Ichiro Anna, your covenant serves you well, but it will serve me far better. Why do I feel like that scientist is going to come back alive? I just feel like Onda's going to do something magical and just spawn back. But damn, Iron Mask is, like, savage. So that's it. Ichiro Anda was a Covenant holder too. And we got a good look at Iron Mask. Plus, whatever that freaky, murdery guy was. The guy that tore out Anda's Covenant, you mean? Strength like that definitely isn't human. Maybe it's some new species of bear or something? Melody, you were on Iron Mask's team. Know anything about that? Not really. All I know is he called that thing Zenon. He also referred to it as a vessel for the Covenants. A vessel for the Covenants, huh? It seems he lacked the power to fend off their attack. 
say, Milady, if you and Iron Mask are an item, why is he after you? <laughs> Ringo, what would you say to working together? You help me meet with Iron Mask. What's in it for me? I'll help you prevent this end of the world or whatever you've been going on about. And I'll give you all of the Covenant Holders' names. Deal? You sure? I thought you wanted the world to end. Some things take priority. All right then, Melody. It's a deal. Rather quick to trust, aren't you? Not at all. But we both benefit from this. And for now, that's all I need. Speaking of which, I'm hoping we can count you in too, Arrow. Sure. It's not like I don't have stakes in this. All right, then. It's settled. Let's all just try to get along from here on out. <sighs> hmm. Seeing as he was a double agent, I guess you can't exactly cozy up to him right away, huh? Not in your wildest dreams. Still, I won't drag my feet around, so you've got nothing to worry about there. That works for me. Though if possible, I'd appreciate it if you'd stop glaring at me like that. But of course. Thanks. You guys can do whatever you want, just as long as we work together. On to the main topic. Melody, if you could go over the Covenant Holders for us. Right. These are the five people the Phantom Society had marked as Covenant Holders. First is Iron Mask, leader of the Covenant Recovery Project, or Project C. He's a Covenant Holder as well. The Covenant Recovery Project. How is the Phantom Society able to identify these individuals? A Covenant Holder can detect another simply by looking at them. A quick glance in their direction is all it takes. Coupling that with the organization's power, the Phantom Society has been able to identify Covenant Holders for a long time. Up next, we have Ichiro Onda, our late computer engineer. He held a Covenant, but had no summoning ability. Going off the security footage we just saw, his Covenant is currently being held by that man, Zenon. This means Iron Mask is in possession of at least two Covenants at this time. The third Covenant holder is a Devil Summoner. Mangetsu Kuzunoha. I imagine a certain someone here knows a lot more about him than I do, though. He's one of Yadagarasu's top devil summoners, and one of the key players in protecting this country. There you have it. The fourth is a man named Saizo, who operates out of Karakacho. He's a freelance summoner who's had dealings with both Yatagarasu and the Phantom Society. And lastly, our fifth Covenant holder was me. Though that's clearly not the case anymore. That's the one I currently have. So many of them have switched owners in such a short time. It's kind of hard to follow. Hang on a sec. Does that mean Iron Mask was targeting those two Covenant Holders at once? If that's true, then the others could be in danger too. Milady, any idea where Saizo might be? Where it is, he's typically hanging around Bar Hydran about this time. It's over on Jinsando Street. 
Then that's where we gotta go. You coming, Fig? I'll wait here for everyone. If worse comes to worst, we can't allow our enemies to obtain any more covenants. That said, you'll need an operator of sorts to appraise the situation. So allow me to play that role from the back end. Roger. We'll let you handle things here then. Milady has joined the party. You can now navigate to Shin Zandu from the city map. The safe house is the team's base of operations. If you select rest from the menu, the party will fully recover HP and MP. Also, certain downloadable content items can be collected at the safe house. Select DLC from the menu to claim any items you've downloaded. However, keep in mind that it's attempting to receive any items over your maximum limit will result in the extra items being discarded. Yeah, just don't have more than a limited item amount, I guess. Okay. Alright, now I'm going to save game because it's time to just save and end it there. We're going to end it in the safe house, so let me return to title. I hope everyone enjoyed their Soul Hackers experience and we'll play more soon. And I look forward to seeing you all again. So take care everyone and goodbye.